capital budgeting is the process in which a business determines and evaluates potential expenses or investments that are large in nature. Those expenditures and investments include projects like building a new plant or investing in a long-term venture. Classifications Non-discounted method It does not explicitly consider the time value of money. So, each dollar earned in the future is assumed to have the same value as each dollar that was invested many years earlier. Discounted method. It does consider the time value of money and therefore, incorporate the concept of discounting cash inflows and outflows. Techniques. Payback period. It is the length of time required to recover the cost of an investment. It is a determinant to whether undertake the position or project as longer payback period are typically not desirable for investment positions. Net present value. It is the difference between the present value of cash inflows and present value of cash outflows. It is used to analyze the profitability of a projected investment or project. Accounting rate of return. It is the amount of profit or return an individual can expect based on an investment made. Internal rate of return. It measures the profitability of potential investments. It is a discounted rate that makes the net present value of all cash flows from a particular project equal to zero. Profitability index. It attempts to identify the relationship between cost and benefits of a proposed project. Payback period. Advantages. 1. Simple to compute. 2. Provide us some information on the risk of investment. 3. Provides a crude measure of liquidity. Disadvantages. 1. No concrete decision criteria whether the investment increase the firm's value. 2. Ignore cash flows beyond the payback period. 3. Ignores the time value of money. 4. Ignores the risk of future cash flows. Net present value. Advantages. 1. Tells whether the investment will increase the firm's value. 2. Considers all cash flows. 3. Considers the time value of money. 4. Considers the risk of future cash flows through the cost of capital. Disadvantages. 1. Requires an estimate of cost of capital in order to calculate the net present value. 2. Expressed in terms of dollars, not as percentage. Internal rate of return. Advantages. 1. Tells whether the investment will increase the firm's value. 2. Considers all cash flows of the project. 3. Considers the time value of money. 4. Considers the risk of future cash flows through the cost of capital and the decision rule. Disadvantages. 1. Requires an estimate of cost of capital in order to make decision. 2. May not give value maximizing decision when used to compare to mutually exclusive projects. 3. May not give the value maximizing decision when used to choose projects when there is capital rationed. 4. Cannot be used in situations in which the sign of the cash flows of a project Change more than once during the project's life. Profitability Index Advantages 1. Tells whether the investment will increase the firm's value. 2. Considers all cash flows of the project. 3. Considers the time value of money. 4. Considers the risk of future cash flows through the cost of capital. 5. Useful in ranking and selecting projects when capital is rationed. Disadvantages. 1. Requires an estimate of cost of capital in order to calculate the profitability index. 2. May not give the correct decisions when used to compare mutually exclusive projects. Accounting rate of return. Advantages. 1. R is based on accounting information. Therefore, other special reports are not required for determining R. 2. 
R is easy to calculate and simple to understand. 3. R method is based on the accounting profit, hence, measures the profitability of the investment. Disadvantages 1. R ignores the time value of money. 2. R method ignores the cash flow from investment. 3. R method does not consider terminal value of the project.